to be here in, uh, where am I? I'm in San Diego, California. I'm excited to be in San Diego. I, I want to share with you, you know, some principles, some ideas on how you can really change your life. Raise your hand, raise your hand by a show of hands if you would like to elevate your lifestyle. Now success is the progressive realization of a worthy ideal, okay? Money makers are note takers, by the way. You can see the people in the front row, they're making money, they're taking notes. What, what amount of money do you need a month for you to be like, Yes. Everybody say yes. yes. What kind of money do you need for you to wake up every morning and say, thank you, God, I am so happy and grateful, right? What kind of number? $10,000 a month? $5,000 a month, right? I don't know, but you got to figure that out. What do you desire? If you're not living where you would like to be living, I want you to visualize a home you would like to be living in. Successful people, okay? There are two cornerstones of success. How many cornerstones? Two. How many? Two. Okay, two. You don't have to change the principle. That's not how you become successful. You have to find people that know what they're doing and copy them, right? So industriousness, that just means working hard. Everybody say work hard. You got to work hard. You can't cheat that, right? Number two is enthusiasm. Why do, why do we always talk about energy? Why do you go to big events and people making you stand up and clap and scream and yell and turn to the person on your left and give them a high five and all these different things? It's not because it looks cool on social media. It's because it helps you attract success. Who do you take advice from? Who is in your ear? But if you're telling me Lamborghini, Ferrari, Rolls Royce, I wanna to go to Bali, I wanna to go to Bora Bora, I wanna to go to Dubai, I wanna donate 100 grand a year to my church, I wanna do more for people in Guatemala and Africa, you wanna do all these great charities and stuff, you have to listen to people that guess what? Have what you want. And that would seem like common sense. Like, you're not going to go up to Alex Morton and say, hey, man, I want to be a professional soccer player. Will you coach me on how to do that? I don't play professional soccer. Some of you are taking business advice from people that don't know how to run a business. Who do you listen to? Right? You got to listen to people that know what they're doing and know where they're going, right? And have been where you want to go. So if all you got tonight was, hey, I got to find rich people and I gotta do what they do. That's worth millions of dollars right there. When you're humble, you get more. When you're grateful, you get more. All right, so here you go, two sides of success. Okay, spiritual, this is 95% of success. 95% of success has nothing to do with the work. You have to work hard, yes. But you have to get everything up here right first. Your thoughts, what do you think about? What do you think about? My mentor told me, Alex, if most people said out loud what they were thinking, they'd be speechless. People don't think because we've never been taught how to think. You have to get your goal in front of you as much as you can. The background on your cell phone, the background on your computer, in your bedroom where you sleep, what's on your walls? What's on your walls? Put your dream car on your wall. Put your dream house on your wall. Get your goals. My mentor said get your goals in front of you and look at them as much as you can. Because whatever you see, you attract. Thoughts, feelings, images, emotions, right? I'm almost done. You have to start to see yourself where you want to be. You have to tell yourself how great you are. You have, to be your, you have to be yourself's number one cheerleader. You really do. You really, you have to pump yourself up. No one's going to pump you up. You got to pump yourself up. So thoughts, feelings, and then when you're, when you're thinking what you want and you're feeling good, one of the secrets that I was taught was you got to feel good now all the time. What does that mean? It means you gotta feel good all of the time. Regardless of what's going on, you have to put yourself in a positive vibration and be easy flowing and loose and just feel good. You gotta feel good all of the time. So you have to see the result before it happens. Thank you for watching. For more videos on how to be, do, and have everything in life you desire, subscribe now. And remember, if you can dream it, you can do it.